So Marion is obviously the full package. So when my mom would introduce me and my older sister and Marianne to anybody, it would go something like this. This is Mary Ann. She's beautiful and she's a singer and she's a dancer and a performer and she's invested in her faith and she's just perfect. Oh, and uh, this is Hannah and that one's Aaron. <laughs> Brzezinski's, I don't know how you made this rascal into the man he is today. Uh, and the, I, I don't know, like he got really lucky here. I guess, he, you know, it's, He's got a great personality, I suppose, you know. And as we did marriage preparation and I got to know Marianne, I was really convinced that she's practically perfect in every way. But Robert, on the other hand, whoo! <laughs> I haven't even read a word. Rob and Marianne, welcome to this day when two become one. It's kind of hitting me right now. <laughs> and I'm laying on your lap. <laughs> I need to be forever. Exactly one year ago today, I got down on my knee and professed my love, my commitment, and my deepest desire to spend the rest of my life with you. Have the craziest butterflies ever. Oh, so really Not you, Dad. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Baby, these are so pretty. I started gathering my thoughts for your letter on a rainy Thursday afternoon after Father Luke asked me. Is Rob worth living and dying for? Rob and Marianne, I hope that you never forget from this day onwards that you are worth dying for because you are pledging that faithful, committed love to each other. Well, if you are reading this letter, it means that we are moments away from saying I do. Moments away from giving our lives to each other in marriage. My love for you has never wavered. My commitment to you has only strengthened, and I now know what true love is because you have given it to me day in and day out. You are the most beautiful expression of selfless love. Your love is always forgiving and resembles that of the Lord's. Hachi moment. Oh my gosh, Maria, is this really happening? <laughs> Mm, so beautiful. Thanks, Dad. Don't cry. Don't cry. You I got makeup. I know. Oh my gosh. Let me see the whole. You just look absolutely stunning. You're a beautiful bride, and I don't want to give you away yet. Oh, thanks, Dad. Mm, I love you. I love you too. He had incredible plans, plans beyond my wildest imagination, to prepare me to be your bride. In a few moments, those doors will open, and I will be there. I'm going all in. And I'm not scared to get lost in your love because you are worth dying and living for. Rob and Marianne, you are going to not just give us this image of what real love looks like. You are going to, at this day, become the living image of what real love looks like. Rob, you're so worthy. And you're so loved by me. can't fall asleep because reality is finally better than your dreams. I like this quote because it reminds me of Marianne as a child. I think that ever after she, since she saw The Little Mermaid, she saw Ariel's wedding, it had to be just as magical and just as perfect. And honestly, I don't think that she could have imagined a more perfect night than tonight. So tonight, those dreams do become reality. All right, so we're gonna cut the cake and then uh, we're gonna boot, scoot, and boogie. I am in awe of how beautiful God's promises are. 
being children of God together and being your husband will be the greatest titles that I will ever hold.